Hello and welcome back to another Yellow Case tutorial. I'm going to show you how to import a media patch into Caldera. So what I'm going to do is launch Easy Media by clicking and dragging it down. And since it's a media patch, I'm going to select the printer icon, click on Next. I'm then going to select the printer that I want to import that patch into, and I'll click on Next. You'll notice that I have a list of medias here that I've custom calibrated, but I have one more that I want to import um, and I'm going to click on install patch here. When I do that, all I need to do is navigate to where my patch is. Now, in this case, it's on my desktop, so I'm going to double click on desktop and I'm going to select it here. I'm going to point out, you'll notice it here on my desktop as well, but you have to import it through this dialog box. You'll also notice that this patch has the name already in it. So it says Epson 9900, so it's for the 9900 only. And it's for the Epson Exhibition Fiber Paper. So I made this calibration a while back. I want to re-import it. And I'm going to click on Load. Once I do that, it'll tell me that there's one profile in here. It was made for 720 DPI. So I'll just click on Install All or Install Selection. In this case, it doesn't make a difference because there's only one. So I'm going to type in the password, the default password in Caldera for the uh, installation, the administration password is always Caldera. And I'll hit OK. It tells me a one new profile was installed. I'll just click OK again, and there it is, Epson Exhibition Fiber. So I can quit out of here, and that's done. I've installed that patch, and I'm ready to use it. If I go to my 9900, it should be available in my list here. And there it is, Epson Exhibition Fiber. Okay, well, I hope this helps. Uh, please keep watching, and you can subscribe so you can be notified when I make new videos. Thank you.